No one can match his speed going out. Take your mark. Three swimmers from the Wolf Pack, so they're going to gain some valuable points from this race. And unusual, nobody from Texas, Cal, or Arizona State. Don't get used to that. It's about the only race that won't have at least one from those teams. Along quickly, as expected, Leendo, Kirstani of NC State. And Ramadan of Virginia Tech flips second 800s behind Leendo. Well, Ramadan's the only other one that had broken 44. He was right there with Leendo, and he's got a good back half. Look at Ramadan. Ramadan just now popping free with the lead on Leandro. It's Yusuf Ramadan of Virginia Tech. 43-15, and the Hokies have a national champion. How about that? that? It was not a slam dunk. And what a swim for the junior, Ramadan. He was fifth in the 50, so you know he had the speed. But he came home. Jeez, he was 22-9 on the way back. Leandro was fantastic coming back. He's 23-2. He was the second fastest coming home. But Ramana, finally, yeah, finally. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> Third in the event last year. And the top seed entering these championships. And that is the second fastest time in history. Second fastest performance in history as well. Both of them the second and third fastest in history. Ramadan goes the second fastest in history. And there's Leando right in front of you. Ramadan right there to the left. Watch him. What a great breakout he had. That was a perfect breakout right at the 15-meter mark. Stuck that wall. And wins it. What a swim. What a swim. Sergio Lopez, the coach at Virginia Tech, he'll be thrilled with that as well. So here are the official results of the 100-yard butterfly. And Blacksburg, Virginia has a national champ, Yusef Ramadan, 43-15 to take it down. I think that's their first ever. Yusef, you were the second fastest performer in history and finally an NCAA champion. How confident were you heading into tonight that you could pull this off? Oh my God. Like, uh, after three years, finally, three years, uh, like these guys, they were always faster than me. I came from zero, you know? Every year I had a chance to win, but something happened. And finally, it's my time, you know? So many people had faith in me. So many people had faith in me because they know that I put the, the hard work in this. The, it, like, I, I put so much into this. I sleep every day early like a bot. Wake up 5 a.m., swim in cold pool. I hated it. I hated it. But I knew every... I would say one day I'm going to be NCAA champion. One day I'm going to be NCAA champion. Today is finally that day. I am NCAA champion. Yeah. What an incredible race, and it was obviously a long journey to get here today. Tonight, what did you need to do in terms of details within the race to make sure that you got your two hands on the wall first? Uh, I have no idea, but... <laughs> I, I just, you don't need to know. I just, uh, I had to stay calm, you know? Because these people that were with me, they're the fastest in the world. So to be with them, you know, means it's like, it's hard, you know. And there's fear when you're up against like the fastest in the world, you know. Yeah. Well, you are also the fastest in the world, Yusef. Congratulations, NCAA champion.